Hey, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Astros versus White Sox Major League Baseball matchup on Saturday, August 17th, 2024. If you like all the free picks we do at Pick Dogs, you'll love our premium picks, our best bets. You just go to PickDogs.com, click on the premium picks tab. Also put a link in the description below this video, making it nice and easy for you. So lots of ways to get our regular premium picks. And of course, we also have VIP premium picks, but that's meant for people that bet like a thousand or more per game, have a $10,000 plus bankroll. For those, you text the number. Of course, not a free pick line or trial. It's our most expensive premium picks. We have something for everyone. Premium picks plus, of course, with free picks like the video you're watching right now. But let's get to it. It's the Astros taking on the White Sox. Hunter Brown on the bump for the Strohs. Chris Flexen on the mound for the White Sox. And the Astros starting to make do some damage here in the American League West. Such a familiar role. Some changing faces, of course, over the years. You know, guys have left the Astros, signed on with other teams. Pitchers, you know, have been rotating in and out of this Astros rotation. But I'll tell you what, the results are the same. And that is a team that is just very, very dangerous with the batting order from top to bottom, who all just seem to click at the right time. You know, Jose Altuve and Alvarez kind of carried them through the rough patches, kept them, you know, relevant, I would say. And now with Bregman hitting the ball the way he is and everybody else joining in, this Astros team just looks absolutely loaded and dangerous. Hunter Brown, who was horrible to start the season, has really picked up the pace. And while he's not perfect, we saw the four runs he allowed against the uh, Pittsburgh Pirates a few uh, games back. But I'll tell you, bounced back with one run allowed against the Rangers and two runs allowed against the Red Sox. And for the bulk of it, we have seen some pretty strong performances from Hunter Brown who's down to a 3.96 ERA this season. He's given up 15 home runs. A lot of those, though, were a long time ago in, in, the, in the grand scheme of things. He has struck out 139 batters over 127 and a third innings of work. He's walked 48. And like I said, a lot of the negative numbers for Hunter Brown are long ago. And you look at his last three starts, 3.71 ERA. And like I said, not, hasn't really even been at the top of his game. Chris Flexen on the mound for the White Sox. This guy, you know, has done a reasonable job for the Sox. Kind of just one of these pitchers that you throw out there and hope that he logs some innings. Sometimes he gets rocked for six runs like he did against the Minnesota Twins in an inning and a third, um, two starts back. Sometimes pretty decent, like last time out against the Cubs. Zero runs in four innings of work, but he did walk four batters and, you know, allowed three hits. So it was a little dicey. A lot of pitches for just a short amount of time in the game. You know, Flexen, most of the time, though, two or three runs allowed on his good ones, his bad ones, well, seven or more. But he's got a 5.34 ERA on the season, 19 home runs allowed, 84 strikeouts, over 118 innings of work. Over his last three starts, pretty much par for the course, 6.17 ERA. We look at the way these teams are hitting the baseball recently and versus right-handed pitching over their last 10 games. The White Sox hitting a surprising 273 versus righties, while the Astros hitting 260 versus right handed pitching. The Astros' bullpen to me has looked very, very shaky at times, but still check in with a 2.53 ERA over their last 10 games. A, a run or more than a run better than their season bullpen ERA of 3.62, while the White Sox bullpen 5.86, more blown saves than I believe anyone in the history of baseball. Easily the blown save and, and blown, um, you know, uh, blown or whatever you want to talk about. 40-something leads they've blown the bullpen this season. One of the worst I've ever seen. But anyways, um you know, when you look at this game, it's the haves versus the have-nots. I think that, you know, you look at the White Sox hitting numbers there and you say, well, maybe they can keep it close or whatever, but I don't think they keep it close long enough. I'm going to take the Astros. I'm going to lay the run line, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com, 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.